So I'm sorry I sound like an 80 year old drill sergeant, but I wanted to tell you guys something that I really think will help and hopefully it helps you in any decision you're making, whether that's getting a new job, starting a new business, moving to a new town, doing anything that's scary and uncomfortable. My wife and I, when we first were gonna buy that Airbnb property, here's the season of life that we were in. She was nine months pregnant. We had some serious medical issues that we didn't have the answers to yet. Um, we drained years worth of savings to purchase this property. We had zero, zero idea of what we were doing. We've never decorated an Airbnb property, never purchased stuff for Airbnb. We've never gone down that path of knowing what to do with maintenance, with cleaners, with plumbers, with construction. We had zero idea. We still have zero idea, right? But at that point in our life, if I wouldn't have taken that step and made that decision, we would be in the same exact track that we're in right now. And we would have never done anything outside of that. It was scary. We went broke actually purchasing that property, putting everything to it. We could still put food on our table, but things were very, very tight guys. And we are the definition of middle-class real estate, man. And the reason I'm telling you guys this is the only way that we learned was putting our feet to the fire and just learning and failing. We bought the rock, wrong color of paint. We got the wrong furniture. We had stuff that was broken. We had not enough rollers. We had frozen pipes. We had all these things that we had to only learn because we did it. And so what I'm trying to say is if you have a crazy idea, get 70 to 80% of the information you need and make that qualified decision and go for it, guys. I still don't know what I'm doing. I'm still a master of nothing. But what we did is we took a decision and we built something that we can both be proud of. It was this coolest experience in the world to see my wife excited about something. Was she scared? Yes. Was she telling me I was an idiot? Yes. Was she supportive of me the whole time? Yes. But if we wouldn't have made that decision, we wouldn't have been able to fast forward a year, have passive income, get to enjoy a place down in the hills and have friends and families and clients that can go enjoy that property. I'm telling you guys, the only way to learn is to throw yourself into the arena. The man in the arena is a real thing. You have to learn from your failures and you have to learn from your wins. And we wouldn't have been able to do it if we wouldn't have put our backs against the wall, drained our savings accounts, made a step while she was nine months pregnant. Just months after that is when we had our first kid and uh, we had some medical issues that we didn't know. And so I hope that this can be a kick in the pants for anybody.